Greetings, folks. What I'm attempting to do here is to further people's understanding of what FAR is. FAR, as you will have read by now, is floor area ratio. It is a measurement or calculation of density as pertains to construction and development. What I've done, I've got a, a, a very crude 3D mock-up. This piece of plywood represents a, a, a piece of land, a, a plot of land. It's about 12 inches square in between my margins, which represent on this side a sidewalk, and on this side half of one of our alleys. This piece of land is on Westward Drive. When you drive down Westward Drive, you will see a very good representation of what we currently have in the city of Miami Springs, which is a FAR of 0.5. This is a one-story building that is built on a piece of land, and it covers half of that piece of land. This is FAR 0.5 and is representative of approximately 80% of our current commercial and neighborhood business district's level of build-out. When you drive down westward, there are some two-story buildings, but the density of what you see, the aggregate of that density, is essentially this. Currently in the city of Miami Springs, our code, our town charter, allows in the commercial and neighborhood business districts a FAR of 1.0 represented by this. This is the same piece of land with a building on it whose footprint is twice as big. This is a one-story building that covers the entirety of the piece of land. This is a one-to-one -one ratio. This is FAR 1.0 and is our maximum in our downtown business districts. FAR 1.0 can also be represented like this. This is still FAR 1.0, folks. This is the same piece of land, the same size building. It's just we have created parking, perhaps, and added a second floor. This is still FAR 1.0 as is this, there is your third story, as is this, a fourth story. However, this would require a story variance, as our current rules and regulations allow for three stories and 40 feet of height. This is FAR 1.0. This is where we are today.